methods of separation. Separation of substances can be done by different methods like hand picking, threshing, winnowing, sewing, sedimentation, decantation, filtration, and evaporation. Hand picking. This is a named method of separating large sized impurities, stones, and husk from the grains. It is a convenient method but requires lot amount of time. Threshing This is a process used to separate grain from stalks. The stalks are beaten on a rock to free the grains. Machines are used to thresh large quantities of grain. Winnowing It is the process used to separate heavier and lighter components of a mixture by blowing air. Farmers use this method to separate lighter husk particles from heavier seeds of grain. Separated husk is used as fodder for cattle. Sewing This is the method used to separate components of a mixture present in different sizes. Example Seeds are used to separate pebbles and stones from sand. Sedimentation, decantation and filtration Sedimentation is the method by which water is added to a mixture and heavier components are made to settle down. Decantation is the process of removal of topmost water after sedimentation. Filtration is the process by which pure liquid without any solid particles is obtained using a strainer. Example, fruit juices are filtered to separate seeds and pulp. Evaporation This is a process of conversion of water into water vapor. This is a separation method by which salt can be separated from salt solution prepared by dissolving it in water. Salt solution is heated and allowed to boil thereby allowing water to evaporate, leaving back the salt crystals. Multiple separation methods These are the combination of two or more separation methods. Example, when a metal plate with ice is held on the steam, coming from the kettle, steam condenses and forms liquid water. This process of conversion of water vapor into its liquid form is called as condensation.